Okay, now I need to check something real fast before I hop onto this question. I need to check that no one is um, trying to stream right now. Awesome, so I can go for another little bit of time. Okay, awesome. So we got our next question on the menu. We can keep the stream going and keep the math and magic happening. Um, our next question, also a little bit mathematic, math and magic. So we got Jill, and she got a fish that is eight times heavier than a parakeet. That's a heavy fish. I think a parakeet is a bird, right? So. That's a heavy fish. Uh, together, the parakeet and the fish are 63 ounces together. That's a, that's a couple pounds. I think they're 16 pounds in a, or 16 ounces in a pound. So it's a couple pounds. How much does the fish weigh? That's a heavy fish if it's eight times heavier than a parakeet. Let's uh, ignore like all, all the biology stuff and let's just focus on the math. So uh, with this sentence, we can extract some equations from here. So let's set up some uh, some variables and give them and um, show what they represent. So if we have uh, f, let's call this f, and that will be fish weight. And let's say p, this will be parakeet weight. This might be a shark or a very small parakeet. <laughs> okay, so we know that the fish is eight times heavier than the parakeet. So, um, fish weight is equal to, fish weighs eight times more than a parakeet. So eight parakeets are gonna be one fish in weight. Let's, we're not going to think about the biology. This this is a big fish. Like this is a shark. Okay, so we got the fish is eight times heavier than the parakeet. The parakeet's weight times eight. That's the fish weight. Okay, together the pets are sixty three ounces. So sixty three ounces is equal to the weight of the fish plus the weight of the parakeet. Okay, so we can actually um, isolate the weight of parakeet. Of P, and we know that that is P is one eighth the weight of a fish. We can sub that into here. And we know that 63 is the weight of the fish plus the weight of a parakeet, which is one eighth of a fish. Um, we can actually add these together. So that's going to be 9 over 8 fish is equal to 63 ounces. So we can um, multiply both sides by. 8 over 9 times 63 is equal to 8 over 9 times 9 over 8 of the fish. Those neutralize and those neutralize. So we know that the weight of the fish, 8, um, so this is going to be 8 times 63 divide 9. So we got 56 ounces of fish. The fish is 56 ounces. How many pounds is that? 16 pounds in one ounce. That's three and a half pounds of fish. That's like, that's a heavy fish. 
Maybe not a shark. Maybe a baby shark. Do 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 do. But uh. So the fish weighs 56 ounces, and um, the parakeet is going to be much lighter at 7 ounces. So the parakeet is like half a pound, and the fish is 3.5 pounds. Uh, heavy fish, but um, yeah, <laughs> it all works out. In the end, the math is actually very simple. Um, of course, there's all these distractions of like the fish and the context of it, but... Um, that's that's close to real life because you're never just going to be given just an equation you'll have to derive an equation given a real life situation even if these real life situations are confusing and involve extremely heavy fish that are three and a half pounds but it's all good um, the above solution is good <laughs>